Hey Huskies, I'm hanging out with Maddie Rodriguez in the Care Union building, and she's gonna tell us a little bit about the Multicultural Affairs Office. Hi Maddie, how are you today? Good, how are you? Can you start by telling me a little bit about what the Office of Multicultural Affairs is and what your role is within the office? Well, I'm the director of the Multicultural Center here at Bloomsbury University. Um, and the Multicultural Center is um, a home away from home. That's how we, we, we identify ourselves. We are a resource center. More importantly, we um, intentionally provide conversation about our race, ethnicity, social justice, bringing our campus uh, community together with our college campus. So um, that's a little bit about who we are and what we do, but more importantly, we are here for the students. We create a safe and brave space for them to come and um, pick up resources, talk to our student workers, speak to me. I work with all 10,000 of our BU Bloomsburg students. Can you tell me why a student might come to your office? Um, many times our students might come to our office, they're either picking up um, information for a class or they're doing a project, or sometimes they may have encountered, um, whether it's, it's not bullying, but inappropriate behavior about um, race or ethnicity that they have experienced in a classroom or outside of the classroom so they may need someone to speak to or um, just in general they may want to come to one of our training sessions to learn more about being an ally or being um, non-microaggressions that may come about and learning more about them. So our students, there's a variety of things. Some of them just come and read a magazine, talk to us for hours on end, so they really may not need um, our assistance. Our office is always open and we're packed. Students are always coming in and out. And, and like I said, sometimes um, the need may just be they just wanna to talk to someone or say hello to me or to some of our student workers. What's a unique service that your office has that a student might not know about? I would say a unique service that our students may not be aware or may not utilize is we offer um, a number of mentoring programs and we pride ourselves on our mentoring programs. Our graduation rate for students that participate in our mentoring programs are 80%. Um, and some of our, just to mention two of them, um, the first one is called Aki and Aura. And it's not just for our Latino students transitioning from high school to college, it's for all of our students who feel that they may need that assistance because sometimes coming from high school to college, you may not be completely prepared. So we offer those services and we pair you up with a Bloomsburg um, upperclassman, whether they're Latino or non-Latino. And I think that's why that program has been very successful. We have another program um, for our male students because our retention rates for male students weren't that great either. So that program has been in existence for over 10 years. And we're now, um, we work with alumni, male alumni that come back and speak to our students. So we, we're very proud of those two programs that maybe our BU students may not know about. What are some notable events or activities that our Huskies can look forward to in the next coming year? Oh, we have a number of them. Um, our first will be our faculty, not faculty, but our lecture series that we bring in speakers um, to talk about different issues, whether it's on immigration, whether it's on race relations, whether it's just being um, an amazing student leader and what does that look like on our campus. So we have our lecture series beginning um, in September. We have an open house, so we meet all of our students that come through. We share our calendar with them. Um, we have our annual events, like our Martin Luther King um, commemoratory event, which is held every February. And we have our National St. Kofa Conference, which is more or less like our diversity conference for the entire university, which is held in February as well. So we have a number of events that we pride ourselves in and have been a legacy for our university. Our Martin Luther King event is going into the 26th anniversary. Thank you so much for all you do, Maddie. Thank you. The Office of Multicultural Affairs always has an amazing event going on, and it's also a really great place where a conversation can get started. Be sure to check them out.